What's up everybody? I've uh, did the 4.5 update, hooking the external hard drive up to your PlayStation 4. Um, I've encountered a problem and uh, what it is, is your external hard drive is hooked up, right? Like, yeah. Okay. You got settings of storage, of course. All right. There's your extended storage. Let me show you. Okay. Yeah. All right. Got those applications. All right. I got Battlefield 1 right here. I go back. Okay. By any chance you're close to your PlayStation or anything like that and you bump into it or some stupid random stuff happens, these external hard drives are cheap made. They have a chip that hook up to the USB port. And uh, what it does is if bumped, hit, or anything, it could short. And I'll show you that the way that I have it set up right now is so I can disconnect it and reconnect it to like anything else pretty much. Let's go back still. I don't use Elgato. card capture because why would I pay $150 when I could just hit record on my phone so it is what it is okay you see Battlefield 1 you see the disc symbol right there okay by any chance if you hit it bump it or anything and it shorts out this prompt would show up the extended storage device disconnected was disconnected improperly and uh, pretty much what you can do I'll go ahead and show you first that you can hit OK and a problem has occurred with the extended storage all right if you have to plug it up and replug it and then hit OK and what it'll do is it'll repair the extended storage all right battlefield one right all right check an extended storage please wait all right there's that so that's the problem that i've encountered and i figure I'd, i should make a video about it because it kind of is important because you want to play your games I'll go back to my settings, I'll go to storage, and my extended storage will be back. Because when you short it, it won't find it, and uh, that icon will pop up where the disk is. 